Hey there again, YouTubers. This is Daniel Strong with Excel VBA is Fun. This is lesson number one in our Excel tips and tricks for Visual Basic. Uh, today, we're going to just very quickly, we're going to learn how to make any cell or range of cells to be bold, italic, or underlined. Uh, just like when you click here or when you unclick here. So very quickly, we will hit Alt F11 and we'll zoom right into it. Let's say we're going to make whatever the cell that we select, the selection to be. So we're going to say selection.font.bold equals. And you can either have that to be true or false. So let's click on this selection and we'll hit Alt F11. And let's run our macro. I click within the uh, click within the procedure anywhere and I'm going to hit F5. Let's just to test this, I'm going to type in this cell and sure enough it's already bold. I'm going to unbold it just so we can test that again. Let's go ahead and run our macro on the selected cell F5 and it became bold. Now let's try making it false. Selection.font.bold equals false. F5. Okay good. That's in working order. Let's make it also become italic. Selection.font.italic, you guessed it, equals true. So currently we're telling it to make whatever our selection to not be bold, but we want it to be italic. Let's try it, F5. Now if we want it to be bold and italic, we'd have to make them both true, F5. Okay, sure enough. Now the final thing I want to do, let's comment both of these out. You'll learn how to do that in our VBA basic series. Um, the next one we want to do, I believe, is underline. So let's take the selection dot font dot underline. This one's a little trickier. When you hit equals, there's not really a true or false here. There's a lot of options. You can actually um, you can hit Control J and that will bring up your list of options and typically these kind of things start with XL so let's type XLU because I know it's XL underline XL underline style double or double accounting or none is if you don't want it to be underlined XL under let's see let's do XL underline style single not a double underline let's try that so I'm gonna hit F5 Okay, it underlined it with a single line. Let's try Excel underline style double F5. Okay, we got a double underline. How about, I believe there was one that said none F5. Okay, it took off, uh, took off the underlining. So let's take everything off. We're going to say this is false. The bold is false. And we will uncomment these lines. We want to run everything. F5, that cleans up the cell. So there's your bold, italic, and underline. And again, whenever you're here and you don't know what to do, you hit Control J. It brings up your menu, XLU, and you have your XL underline styles all available here. Thanks for watching, and tune in next time for another awesome tip.